Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, this is going to be part three of Until Dawn. So let's get right into it. All right, and when we last stop, she's standing in front of the sign. So we're gonna see. Here we go. We're gonna snoop. Aha! Look who it is. He knows it. Chris. Okay, this is Chris. He's methodical, he has a crush on Ashley, he's protective and humorous. You scared me. I, I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? Cool. cool. Well, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. That's not nice. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around. Going to blow your mind. Okay. I'll go around here. All right. Let's see. I got this. Who found wanted Milgram Victor? Okay. Okay, gosh. station I'm terrible at this I don't know why they would want me to do this mm. had to figure out the controls sorry guys <laughs> Over here, I was gonna say, well, what am I shooting? Mm. I think I got it. Wow, nice shooting tips. All right, I'm bad. I'm a bad ass. Oh, God. I think that was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, I don't think so, girl. How am I supposed to? Shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh no, this is the same squirrel, I believe. <laughs> Should I shoot it? No, I'm not gonna shoot the poor little squirrel. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sad. I wonder what would happen if I shot the squirrel. I'll go through and play again and shoot the squirrel. <laughs> Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Okay, we are eventually going to check the status updates and the butterfly effect updates and all that stuff. I'll probably do it at the end of this part. It is. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Oh, so you walk right into the bowl. Hey, <laughs> that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked. Keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. Us! He said they found people sleeping in the station. Uh, that's not cool. Okay. 
Let's open the door, I think. Yeah, there we go. Up here. I wanted to do. I might do a little pop up here. What a crazy place to set up house. Black Oak Farm Hotel and Sanatorium. What? For a healthy body and mind. Okay. looking at the cabin I think that is hmm. Let's see what else is over here nothing nothing all right back out the door we go I you coming well uh, I was gonna stay here and get some seeds but I Excited about this creepy ride. The right thing to do. What? You know, get everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell what happened. I'm kind of a little worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. Hmm. Everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Bro, good talk. Oh my gosh. You know what, let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. <sighs> You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the train bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so. so I got moved to the back. And, and next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, Pointless I story. To this day. Match made I can't remember if yesterday, let back, alone the third grade. Puberty, like, three years early. And on that day, I decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off a train rock. I mean, no. You could be riding in this cable car alone. Oh my right gosh. Now, or we're talking to some other person entirely. <laughs> oh, butterfly effect. He's so strange. Okay, this is Jess. This is Mike's new girlfriend, it says. Is that what that says? Yes. She's confident, trusting, and irreverent. Irreverent, I think that says. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Hmm. <gasps> what the heck? Yeah. Jess! Hey! Jessica, over here! Rope? We're stuck wow. in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? No. Guess I have to. How were they gonna get out if she wasn't there? I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Really? Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. So awesome down here. Yeah, right. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be That's not nice. My goodness. 
butterfly she effect has update. Someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. That's not nice. Okay, let's explain. Mike and M split. We're together. Oh. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. That's not nice. She's not nice. Alright, alright. Let's just get up to the library. I'm getting tired of all this nature. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh -huh. oh. Sam? Did you see this view? I'm a holy cow. Sometimes I forget like it's scary. Stop and take it all in. That's not. It's very scary. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Oh, this girl, Emily. She's intelligent, she's Mike's ex, she's resourceful and persuasive. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. And Matt is Emily's new boyfriend. He is motivated, ambitious, and active. No. These girls and are snobby. A bellboy, when you need one. a bellboy, really? I guess he's walking behind you. <sighs> getting chilled. We're almost there. No, I'm getting kind of creeped out. Oh, oh. yeah. It's going to be weird seeing everyone up here again. Hmm. I'm definitely not going to feel like a regular party. What do you think? Ah! Okay. Jesus. <laughs> All right. This is Mike. He is Emily's ex. He's intelligent, driven, and persuasive. And this is getting kind of strange. There's all these exes and new ones, and I, I, I'm having a hard time keeping up already. And unfortunately, guys, I'm going to bring it to an end right here. You know, the whole 15 minute thing. Anyway, um,. As time goes on, I might make longer parts, but for now, if you like this part, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and you guys have a great day. Bye.